All right, friends, we're back on the Ponderosa today. We are going to change the oil after this Westinghouse pressure washer has gone through its break-in period. All right, so I got a little bit creative here. I had to get an oil receptacle up under this thing because the oil comes out. Uh, let me show you. This is the oil drain, and I'm going to use this old oil can right up under here to catch the oil. All right, we got oil still trickling out right there. We're going to uh, let that finish draining. I'm gonna cut some grass in the meantime. We'll get the lawnmower put up and we'll check on that oil. All right, that about does it for the break-in oil change. After the break-in, I still really like this thing and would recommend it at the price point. You just can't beat it. Uh, one note is I put 5W30 synthetic. It comes with 10W30, but the book says that you can use 5W30 across all temperature ranges. And that's easier for me to keep because it is the same thing that my truck uses. God bless you all. We'll be praying for you and we will see you soon.